guys what is going on and welcome to my channel so for today's video i am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the newly released pack cosmetic sweet sensation lip cream now out of the 20 shades they had launched i had picked out only seven of them so do check it out on the description box below on what the shades are and before we can get into the lip swatches formula the pros and cons do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I do upload. And now, let's jump right into the video. So I bought these lip creams from their own website and I do remember the pack website was under maintenance for a very long time and recently is what it is up and running. So these babies retail for 475 rupees for 6.5 grams of product. So the outer packaging looks like this and it is a nice black box and the shade name is mentioned at the sides as well as the numbers are specified at the bottom and the top as well. And coming to the packaging of the product itself, it looks pretty similar to the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, which has a black cap and the shade color like as a packaging. So this is how the Dofer applicator looks like, which is perfect for the formula of this lip cream, which I will talk about in a few minutes. And these are cruelty free as well. Now coming to the most important part, which is the formula of these lip creams. Now these are whipped and they are moussey, extremely light and comfortable. They are matte, they are extremely pigmented, they are transfer proof, they are long lasting and it has that silky, velvety, satiny kind of feeling on your lips. And I have not personally come across such a formula because once I tried it yesterday, I was blown away because of how different and how unique this formula is. Probably there are other brands that have a similar formula, but I personally do not have such a lipstick. And I immediately ran to my mom and I asked her to try it as well and even her mind was blown away. Now, the best way I could describe the texture is like if you have a satin cloth and if you rub it across your fingers like this, that is the feeling you would get when you apply it on your lips and press your lips together. Now, that feeling does go off in a few minutes, but then after that, it feels like literally nothing, nothing at all. Now, as soon as I applied it, I knew that the ingredients had silicon in it because that is the reason how it achieves that satiny, velvety, that silky kind of a finish on the lips. But then I was really, really surprised about how pigmented these were and also how la long lasting they were as well. Because for example, I had a very light lunch today and I had just some sukha roti and egg buji and the lipstick lasted throughout the lunch and it gave this nice tinted kind of a finish. So I just had to press my lips and I was good to go. And also these are transfer proof, like there is very, very little bit of transfer after the initial application, but after that it will set and it will be perfect. But then if you have a heavy meal, then you will have to reapply because the product will be rubbed off. Now coming to the cons, the first one is to do with the shades. Because when I looked at the arm swatch on their website, there were a lot of reds and pinks or, you know, they all were within the same family of reds and pinks. I really wish they do expand in the future to like darker shades. There was like no maroon, there were no dark purple shades, you know, that vampy shade or even for example, some orangey shade or some more browns and colors like that. That would be amazing. So that is the first con. And the second con has to do with the processing and the delivery time frame. Now, this product was launched on the 6th of July, which is a Saturday. I placed my order on a Sunday and it was pretty late in the night. But then I did get that automated email saying your order has been placed. But then the actual confirmation email that it has been processed and it is out for, uh, you know, for dispatch is when I got it on Tuesday, end of day. And then it got delivered to me only on Friday, again, end of day. So I felt that, that was a very long wait because I have also recently ordered from Lakme. It did not take that long. I have ordered from Sephora India website. It did not take that long and Nika is pretty fast for me as well. Just that I felt that this delivery time and the whole processing time was pretty lengthy. But again, I do not know if it is just for me or not or is it even for others, but these are just my personal thoughts. 
So overall, do I feel this is worth buying for 475 rupees? Hell yes, it is because just because of the texture, the comfort, I cannot emphasize how comfortable these are and also the pigmentation is on point. So these are completely worth buying and also I feel that this is one of the best launches overall in 2019 and this just not includes in lip products but just overall makeup, I feel this is one of the best launches of the year. So now let's finally move on to the lip swatches. So this wraps up today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever i do upload like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i'll try my best to do that for you as well as follow me on my socials which is it's nishanayar on instagram and it's nishanayar on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye